Hey what is up guys Shazad here and welcome to my full review of the Galaxy Note 4 ROM for the Galaxy Note 3 and 9005 as of now it is only available for the Snapdragon variant. So this ROM takes a little bit from both the Galaxy S5 and the Note 4 combined for an amazing experience. Not all the Note 4 features are here but we can expect it in the future updates. But for the sake of this video, I am gonna call it as the Galaxy Note 4 ROM. So let's get started. So first of all, starting with the lock screen, we have the latest Note 4 lock screen here with the clock widget up top. And you get the new unlock effects and you do have lots of other unlock effects to choose from. Now at the bottom you can see the new camera shortcut as well. Unlocking the device you can see that it looks really really similar to the Note 4. We have the latest iteration of TouchWiz up and running. This ROM also has the Galaxy Note 4 launcher. You can turn on my magazines and stuff. And with the theme chooser you can apply new built in themes. And you also get the Galaxy Note 4 wallpapers. This ROM also comes with the Note 4 weather widget and you can choose between these two. Now taking a look at some of the system apps, contact messaging and dialer app got a big facelift here. Not just these but all the apps has the Galaxy Note 4 UI. Here is the new in-call UI. And look at this, how fast it is to open. I have been using the Samsung phones from a long time now and I have never seen contact and dialer app opening this quick. Here is the new music player from the Note 4 and it looks really good. Here you can see the new equalizers menu. In the notification bar now you can see the new circular toggles and all the features are working here. Ultra power saving mode works well and you also get the grayscale mode in normal power saving mode. Multi window also works but no new functionality is added here. Jumping into the settings, gone is the old dark blue look. And here we have the combination of light blue and white and I am digging it. You can also change the look to list view, tab view and grid view. You can also edit the settings to only show the things that you want. And all the basic functionalities like Wi-Fi, data, Bluetooth is working fine for me and I didn't install any kernel or patches. You get the tweaking zone in the settings which includes all the root app and mods. Motions and gestures are pretty much the same as we had on the Note 3 and we'll talk about the S Pen in a bit. Finally in about device you can see that it is running the Android 4.4.2 and I have the stock kernel here and this is the name tweaked S5 base Note 4 style ROM version 7. Now taking out the S Pen you get the new Note 4 like air command and all the things works perfect. It has the same camera from the Note 3 just themed nothing new front and back camera works and video recording also works.
Going into the app drawer, we have the new S Note app, which includes new calligraphy and fountain pen, and I am loving it. Here's the new calculator, clock, gallery, again from Note 4, new browser, memo app, my files, new S planner and the S voice. Here's the new video player and voice recorder. So guys, I have talked about all of the new features and all the new things that this ROM has. So far, it has been really stable for me. No force closes, no issues, everything is working fine for me. The battery life that I got on the stock kernel is also good. Left my device with 50% of charge at the night and woke up with that 50% of charge. So no issues in the battery department. In the end, I just want to ask you, why buy the Note 4? Of course, it has some better specs, no doubt about that. But if you have the Note 3 and 9005, you must check out this ROM you will be impressed just like me. So before I leave, I wanna give a big shout out to the XDA developer G00H for making this fantastic ROM. So as always, if you enjoyed this video, then hit that like button. And for more root and ROM videos, make sure you're subscribed. Comment down below if you have any questions or queries. Thanks for tuning in guys, and I will catch you all in the next video.